All right, well, nobody said that we were tech wizards. That's 100% sure. So after a lot of Sean, I don't know, toying around with it or something, finally we got both mics to work. Pretty much an hour's worth of stuff. It felt like an hour? Yeah. It was an hour. We crammed it. Okay. We started this at, like, 12 o'clock last night. (laughs) Yeah, I wasn't even here. Sean's been working on this for a long time, and... Finally, he can wipe the sweat off his brow. I would probably say I am the cause of why it didn't work, and I just happened upon a solution as to why it's working now. Yeah, so you were like, you were the FAQ and the troubleshoot all in one? Yeah. Unbelievable. I don't, I don't even want to move. I no. twitch the wrong way, and the whole thing goes. Kind of, yeah. You should be careful. We should quarantine. You it should was... be like Jake Gyllenhaal in Bubble Boy. Yeah, I went there. Was John Travolta in that? He was in the original. What? Oh, boy in the yeah, bubble. Bo- boy in the- I'm old. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what? wasn't there like a straight for TV movie? I, cr- I had to crank my car to get in here today. No, oh, easy. You had to crank the car. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Sometimes Sean has to like kick holes through the bottom of his car and just start pedaling like Fred. Yeah, yes. And if you don't know Fred, we mean Flintstone. Right, Alex? <laughs> You're not going to say a word. Alex is here, but he's not saying a word. So uh, I know you were working hard on getting the mics together. You've uh, you've been working hard on a little something else, haven't you? Yes, we do. We have the national coming up. As you can see, our ugly mugs. That's from two years ago. That's how long ago that was. We still look the same. We still don't look the same at all. You had nice bangs there, Sean. I did. I was rocking sweet bangs. <laughs> That's the way I go. I used to have my hair long. Look at my muscles right there. Check Stop. Them they can't yeah, don't hear touch you. anything. You're gonna break it. Um, but yeah, I just want to say I want to point out real quick. This that says 1 a.m. That is a that's an error. It's actually 12 a.m. Just right yeah. off the gate, people are watching and they're like, "Oh, I'm gonna order something at 12:30." Well, you're not gonna get anything. <laughs> well, there's gonna be a lot of cricket. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of crickets. You're gonna have to wait. But that's the only time change there. Real quick, get it right out of there. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 10 a.m. to 12 a.m. Yeah, that's right. 10 a.m. to 12 a.m. Friday and Saturday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., and Sunday, 10 to 5. So just get that out of the way. But, yeah, that this is uh, that's why, Troy, that's why you're not in this picture. We'll have to get a new one. I think we do. Yeah, we need an updated one with all Or maybe we'll crossed. Photoshop you in the back. Like, right, <laughs> just put right in that crease right like there. Like, maybe we'll, I'll take the logo out. We'll just put your head. <laughs> or put me right in that, like, right in I'll that put diamond your head crease here. that we have. Oh, I'll have Alex wearing a long medallion, Flava Flav style with your head. Who knows Photoshop <laughs> around here, yeah. I'm not touching anything. No, 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 no. You've done it. you've done enough here. I'm the kind of guy that's like, oh, I fixed the virus on your computer that I gave you. That's what I. Do. <laughs> <laughs> that's the kind of technology. That's what I do. At least he's honest. That's right. Um, so, along with the national, you've been working on. You've been working on your own little concoction project. We have. Yes. What's that all about? Okay. Well, we'll scroll down here. I can show you real quick. We'll we'll get to all this stuff in a minute. But let's put our little baby on the forefront here. Three men and a baby. <laughs> Three men and a baby. All right, so right here, it's the uh, the DACW Live Vault Series One. Hopefully, in a you know Series One of many. Um, Turns into volumes. Volume, yes, volumes. So basically, this is what we did. There's a lot of other companies out there that do their own vault or their own big break of stuff, mm-hmm. um, and usually it's it's all contained to sports. And sometimes some of them branch out into your pop culture. So you might get, you know, signed Gene Simmons, signed Arnold Schwarzenegger, whatever, you know, right, you're going to get pop right. culture stuff. Uh, but we were kind of thinking, what what can we do to separate ourselves from everybody else that no one else is offering? Um, and one thing, maybe not everybody knows about Dave and Adams. They come here for sports cards. They come here for the hit parade. Yeah. Um, the non-sport cards. We have a lot of different departments, actually, that um, I thought would be nice to highlight especially on the national stage. Oh, for sure. So we basically went to every department that we have uh, to try to get a couple of items to put it all into one product. So you're basically looking at, yeah, you have your signed sports memorabilia, you have some signed pop culture stuff, but then we went singles. We got sports singles, which you, you can get that elsewhere. Sure. But gaming singles, that's something a little different. Yeah. Video games, toys, comics. We wanted to touch on every department and throw it all in one break uh, and that's where the vault is um, so people can see it on the screen but do you want to kind of describe how these are going to run how how are these vault breaks going to yeah. run during the national so this is what we got as you can see 
Uh, it's time to be announced. That's how we're running all our national breaks. Just you know, if you if you didn't know, once they sell out, we'll put a time and date on it. But for this this specific run, the five breaks are up right now. We sold a few spots in it, which I'm really happy to see. Uh, but we took 50 items. Hence, uh, there's 10 items in each case. That's why there's five cases. Very nice. For this one, we're gonna wait. We're gonna get all five sold out, and we're gonna open them all. And it's a draft style, which is kind of cool. I figured. You know, we could have done a random hit, but with the variety of items that are in there, I wanted to give people a shot. You know, you might buy into it hoping to get a toy, and someone else buys in hoping to get some sports memorabilia, and your toy falls. You might have the eighth pick, but no one else wants a toy. You get what you want. Yeah. So the way it'll work is we got them all up. They're $99.95 a spot. Once it sells out, we'll open it up, and they're actually it's actually in an envelope form. We have all the items here, but to make it look a little flashy and nice, they're an envelope. So it's basically like you're at an award show yeah, and you're, kinda, you're yeah, revealing yeah, yeah. the awards. Oh, there you go. And we'll show, um, and, and other companies have done this before. You open it up, it'll show the picture of the item and then a little description about it. We'll show everybody that. Then we'll do the random. So we'll take spots one through ten, random that off, take everybody's name, random that off using random.org, and then whatever number is next to your name is your draft order. So let's say, Troy, you have the number one pick. Awesome. You're going in. You get to pick. What I like to stress is the drafts that we do here at the at the lounge are really nice because you don't have to be there for the break. You don't have to be there for the draft. Sure. Okay, so we open up the item, we do the random, and then we send everyone an email. And in that email, we give you the time and date of the draft, which is usually 24 hours later uh, the next day. We give you the draft order, the video link, and the items that are picked. Then you email us back your draft list, and we draft off of that. If you want to be live for the draft, you just let us know. Hey, you know what? I'm going to be live, and I'll pick it there. Yeah. So, I mean, that's kind of how it works. Uh, the nice thing, what I can say, we built in, we wanted to kind of like give a little back to, like a thank you for buying into this. So once they all sell out, we'll take all 50 names and put them in a, an additional random and pick one person out of the 50 and that person's gonna get a $300 store credit to use on anything. Uh, Great, yeah, clean your, clean your ears out. Did yeah. you hear that? 300, yeah. 300. Zero, zero. Yeah, so you'll get three hundred dollars. So you have a one in fifty chance, uh, you know, when it sells out. Yeah. The other thing, you know how we do here. We got Fun Dead Alex. That's what he likes to call himself. Uh, myself. Um, there will be other unannounced surprises during these breaks. Well, yeah. I mean, you can't let everybody yeah. just have it all. You can't let them have their cake no. and eat it too. All I can say is, <laughs> all I can say is, if you get the last pick, you might actually end up liking that. Also, I have a few of my favorites that um, do, huh? that uh, if they get chosen after they're chosen after the drafts, I'm gonna send a little something extra. Doesn't How mean they're the that? best. Doesn't mean they're most expensive. They're just my personal favorites. And yeah. If you pick one of my personal favorites, and you're gonna get something cool. And it won't be a signed copy, and I won't send Alex to your house. It'll be something actually cool. Cool or outlandish. It uh, yeah. depends who you well, talk it's to. It's actually cool in my eyes. Right, cool in Sean I. That could be outlandish. But since we're talking about it, let me, uh, I could throw it up on the screen real quick. Oh, there we go. That is definitely what I was going to get into next. Uh, why don't we just have that magical wash away and check these out. Uh, what What exactly are these? Right, what, so what do you want to, what do you want to talk about these? Okay, we'll hold that up too. Can't see this, the shoe in the background. Hey, no, how about that? Yeah. But that's all right. We can lay it at the top. Anyways, so this is a couple of examples of what will be in the vault. Um, and I just I grabbed a couple things to just show how we are similar to the things that you know and love, but also differ from uh, things that you may have seen. Obviously, right there, you got a Luke Skywalker graded figure. Let's put that front and center. We'll show it off. We'll so see. that's one of the items that's actually in this. It's in one of the cases. I have no idea, but it's in there. Someone's going to walk away with that. That's a sweet thing. Star Wars is always popular. It's never not going to be. Yeah, and I mean, what's the idea behind this? I mean, uh, from the original series, like, is it a 70s toy? Yeah. It's, uh, might be 80. We got 80? Yeah. From the 80s, but it's an original, and, um, it's one of those things, you, you, you know, you grade toys now. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh, great anyway. I mean, pretty much, yeah. You know, sometimes you hear toys, you know, but this is something, this is a collector's piece that's, uh, it's always, and I, I chose Luke, because it's Luke. You know, yeah, absolutely. Newer, old. That's a cool thing because he's in the new movies. 
sense. So yeah, I, yeah. It, it's relevant. It's not just a character. What's in a new movie it goes all the way back. So legacy and all that. So that's why we picked that one. I mean, and I just for the people out there that are interested in possibly buying in a spot here. I mean, off the top of your head, just real quick. I mean, what do you know? What something like this would be it's, valued at? It's it's more than the price of the spot. I'll say okay. that. I'll say right. that much right now. And that's fine. I'll say that. Alec, you look like you're having a lot of fun over there drawing some things. I'm sure he is. Um, what do we got next? Next, you got next? Kevin Durant. I mean, come on, you can't go wrong with that. Obviously, maybe, I don't maybe. even think I need to say why. But if you don't know, uh, MVP. Yeah, absolutely. Champion. Champ. Just resigned just, too. Yeah, yeah. Could could go for a repeat. You, you can't you can't go wrong with that guy. For sure, so, that's you know on that. you, it's sports on yeah. card as well. Yeah. Uh, and then this this big dude shoot. Oh, this bad boy. This check, is pretty cool. Check this thing out. Look at this. This thing. Uh, it's actually a canoe. This is actually uh, a small. This is Honey I Shrunk. Yes. The canoe. That is. That? Uh, that's Gronk. Rob Gronkowski right there, and it's uh, it's pretty cool. Signed shoe. It's inscribed. Um, Seventeen TDs to twenty eleven. Yeah. So again, pick this one. Uh, regardless of what he does, I like it because it's inscribed. So it's specific to the moment in time. Great too, because it's certified by our friends at JSA. Yeah, so I mean, it, it's nice just something piece. different. Yeah, you might have a Gronk Auto, but you probably don't have it inscribed like that. So I, I don't think you have one of his cleats either. Yeah, it adds, it adds, it adds stuff to it. And then we got this one right here. Um, Let's see if we can. Uh, pop all right, this so this up is the here. thing. There you go. So this this comic is in there, and yes, it's Batman. I literally picked it because of the cover. Lions and tigers and bears. Yeah. I mean, it's 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 definitely it, it's worth the price of admission, but I just found it I, I don't know hilar like hilarious that there's a tiger on the cover of this Batman. I do um, love that. Bat might. Yeah. It's it's nineteen it's a 1961 comic, which is the same year I was born. So you know, there's a lot of things that are that connect me to this guy. <laughs> Sixty one. Yeah, I'm older than I look. Oh, of course. He's older. Benjamin Button over yeah, here. Something like that. But anyways, we'll bring it back to the website. Benjamin Button over here. All right. So anyways, yeah. So that's just a couple of things that are in there. Like I said, it's all it's it's all over the place. You know how we run it here in the lounge. It we get wild and crazy, and because this is ours, it's a DACW live product. It's the first time we're doing this. Um, you know it's going to be fun. You want to get in on it. I think it speaks for itself. So uh, I was thinking over here while you're talking. Uh, what are some of the other breaks that? You, like you are kind of excited about that you'd like to see get filled up what are what are some of your picks you know my ones that, picks yeah ones that you'd like people to get into that right. uh, you and think are worth a while for different for a number of different reasons but so we got this hit parade graded card edition up for baseball and we haven't done this before so i'm kind of interested to see what actually comes of this because you know i'm a football guy and i'm hoping if the baseball does good and maybe they'll do a football. I was you know, say, so, then like, football yeah. will come after. But, um, right? but I'm actually interested just to see because this is one of those ones where everyone gets a card. It's already graded. You don't have to pay the money to get the card graded, and it's a key. It's a key issue card of right. some sort. Yeah. So I feel like that's kind of cool. It's new. It's different. If you love the Hit Parade brand, this is something that uh, you definitely want to get into. And uh, from your recollection, uh, maybe that's not the word I want to use, but to your knowledge, we'll say. Um, does it span like from sixties to um, today? Um, I actually can show you right here. Here's some of the key cards. Oh, okay. You got a fifty six Koufax, Robinson fifty seven, Jackie Robinson fifty three. There's a mantle in there. You got a Derek Jeter rookie. You know, and you also look for these guys, Harper Bryant. So I mean, you know, it's, it's a good mix. It's a good it's mix. It's definitely a good mix. It's, it's a good mix. And um, this one's a random card break. So this one is we'll open it all up and you'll get one of the cards. Great. Really random. You never so know. somebody's so everybody's gonna walk home with something. Yeah. So that's yeah, that's so you, always so good. Something. So that 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 would be my baseball pick. Uh, tier one, just for relevant. I mean, it's tier one. It's new. Judge. Yeah, Honestly, absolutely. It's, it's, it's a newer product. Yeah, it's so fresh. You see it's that. one of the newer. I mean, I, it'll probably be <coughs> one of the. It'll probably be the newest baseball product at the that, time of the national. Well, that correct? we would that we are breaking. that we are breaking. Yeah, 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 okay. But, you know, so baseball, well, usually, I mean, it, it, and it has been this way the last two years, if you've bought into our breaks. Baseball and hockey, we don't have as many breaks. Basketball, sure. we have a ton of breaks. It's just the way it runs. So I was glad that I could at least secure the one, the tier one, to put in there. And yeah. I think it would be nothing better than to pull like a judge or a, a relevant rookie at the Nationals Absolutely. so you could capitalize on it now. Yeah. You got to um, always, that's the thing with cards is you definitely got to be in the now. Um, 
all this platinum basketball it's sold out but i can let you in on a little secret down here i got this one with six spots sell it out i got another one <laughs> sell it out i got another one but anyways um you heard it here first i got more yeah, there are a few breaks that I'm gonna be able to, we'll be able to put more than one break up, um, but you won't know until it sells out if we can get another one. Yeah. So one, you don't want to wait, and two, you want to get it sold out to see if we get another one. So. Sure. But um, I love these because these just have uh, ridiculous players in it. And again, this is another one hit. But you got Jordan, LeBron, Curry, Bryant, Bird, Porzingis, Carl Anthony Towns. It's literally stacked and loaded, and uh, no redemptions. Yeah, I mean, depending on how you view most of the players with that product, I wouldn't say there is a bad name in there. We've done one. We did last series. The last case we did had two Jordans, a LeBron, a one on one Bill. Ross. I don't know. It was stacked. Yeah, it, it, it was. It was crazy. So I mean, I feel like other companies <laughs> can try to compete with something like that, but uh-huh. the names you get in there. <laughs> Alex name, is making the weirdest face. He is. Now. I know. He's throwing me off <laughs> track here. He should just get in here and talk. No, you know? I don't want him to talk. No, <laughs> absolutely um, not. No, I don't know what you're saying. Another one. This is a, a favorite. I'm pointing to the screen like you can see it. <laughs> hey, look at <laughs> like that. You can see your finger. Yeah, you can see your uh, finger. But right. anyways, uh, the all-time greats master collection. That to me is always a fun product. Yeah, um, I've been in the room for a few of those, yes. and they are a blast. They're really cool. I'll let you in on a little secret too. Um, it's worth just watching Alex open the case start to finish. That's that's part of the reason I want to get it sold out because it is um I'm it's hilarious. You're oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> I finally got him to talk. There it is. But I finally um, got him to crack. But yeah, that's that's fun. And again, you, there's variables in there, the redemption, who the box top's going to be. And they're cool cards. Yeah, I mean, somebody and, gets to go home with the damn box. But yeah. The whole box is, like, there's mm-hmm. an autograph in there. Um, I know uh, you asked me what my favorite ones are, but I got to point this out. I literally put these up yesterday, and, you know, we're half sold out, and we sold 20 spots. So, so they're, very, they're going quick. I just got to point that out. Um, yeah, and I, I think that should, I think you saying that should definitely encourage people to just keep checking because you're not, you're going to be throwing, are you going to be throwing some more up? Yeah. We have almost 80 breaks up right now, but I have more. And counting. I have more. I and have more counting. Cases. Yeah. Um, all right, so here's another one I'm going to point out. Yes. It is $369.95 a spot. Yes, I know that sounds like a lot of money, but I'm wondering how many breaks are going to feature a couple of boxes that we have in here. Talking about these four boxes right here. you got a 910 National Treasures and a 910 Exquisite. So that's Curry, Harden, Rookie Years. Oh, yeah. And a bunch of other people. Yeah, big, you big class there's, there. There's, there's Griffin. Blake Griffin's in there. But um, if you're going to say it, say it in the mic. Anyways, three and four. Remember, remember. Um, and then the 0304 SB Authentic in the Ultimate Collection. LeBron, D-Wade, Carmelo, Chris Bosh. Um, but, yeah, so you're getting – those four boxes are going to be in there along with all of these. you got Spectras and Contenders, Gold Standers. Um, so yeah, it, it is a little bit more money, but you're getting the shot. You have the possibility of hitting that life altering card. Oh god, yeah. So I mean, you hit a Curry, you it, hit a LeBron rookie. Just saying, it's, I don't feel like there's going to be that many options out there. So again, that's why we we look to bring this in there, trying to find variety, things you won't find normally, yeah. things you're not going to see throughout the year. So that's why I'm hoping that one will um, will move. And I think that brings me to a good point right there. Perfect. Um, Obviously, if you didn't know already, uh, we won't be traveling um, to the National. Sean and Alex will be back here in the warehouse, but I think it's good to point out now that you have the ability to tap into this stuff because you guys won't be here. You'll have access to the full warehouse, correct? Uh, Yes, that is correct. We will. uh, Last year we were here, and it was absolute mayhem. Um, the nice thing about that is if you're, if there's a case you're looking for us to break as a group, right, you can let us know. It doesn't mean we're going to be able to do it, but we're here at the warehouse, so we're not capped. The only thing would be is if we don't have it, then obviously I couldn't do it. But if you're looking for something, you let us know, and if we can make it happen, we'll make it happen. On the same note, that means we can do personal breaks. If we're not breaking, if we're not doing a group break, that means we're available for a personal break, and you can literally buy anything that's on the website in stock. That's boxes and cases, and we can do that for you. The only thing that, the only reason we won't be able to do it is if we're doing group breaks. So being here at home base, uh, 
it helps everybody. It has its advantages. Yeah, I mean, granted, we're not you're not gonna be able to meet us live, um, but you'll thank me later because that means you don't have to see Alex and be nice. But anyways, um, Troy will be there though. Someone is taking his talents to yes. Chicago next week, and that is you, me. Yes. All right. The yes, face it, it, of the Ace of Your Life. I mean, you know, it's a face made for radio. It is a face made for all That's of us. That's for sure. Yes, yeah. Oh. Three faces nice. for radio. But uh, with that being said, if someone wants, uh, you know, the chance at possibly getting their camera lens broken at the National, why don't we get into uh, some of the gimmicks we're going to be doing? And by gimmicks, I don't... Nope, no, straight gimmicks, yes. We'll it, be, I mean, it pretty much is straight gimmicks. Dress like the Red Rooster and come in. <laughs> Fashion booger. Max yeah, Moon? Yeah, the gobbly gooker. You know. oh. I have some gimmicks that we could run. The Repo Man. Oh. I would dress up like the Repo Man with if I Z. could just, I just start taking people's cards. I think you should. No, favorite, Dr. Isaac Hankum, DDS. Oh, yes. <laughs> ah, yes. Um, but yeah, all right, so gimmicks that we're running. Here's the thing. So Troy's going to be live at the National. He's not going to be there in a breaking capacity. He's going to be there in a, hey, how you doing? Take a look at me. I might buy your cards kind of a capacity. Kind Some, of, like yeah, a something like that. Also like, hey, you, so you go to the DA. Yeah. What do you tell him? I mean, I'll be there hanging out at the booth and by hanging out, uh, you know, we're co- trying to cover my tracks here. Yeah. You know? <laughs> no, I'll, I'll be working, uh, you know, probably slinging some product, talking to some people, uh, possibly buying some cards. But I will be there in some capacity. Right. I'll be at our large booth that I believe we're next. I want to say we're next to Panini. Okay. Or next to Tops. You know, people you'll when they get us. there. You'll see. I was gonna you'll say we'll, we'll you'll be able to find us. And um, so this is what this is what this is what we were thinking. We were talking about this, and we're just gonna put it out there. Um, if you're live at the National, go by the Dave and Adams booth, find Troy, get your picture with him, and then how we would do it on Twitter, right? Sure, so I, add, think, I think Twitter would be the most, or, you know, honestly, people can tag us on Instagram. That, yeah. That'll work, too. So, I mean, if you tag us, take a picture with Troy, and then tag us on Instagram or Twitter, we want to social, you know, whatever one, whatever your fancy is, I'm not going to hold it to you, but yeah. once you do that, you're gonna get, we're going to do something. Something. Yeah, we haven't figured out the specifics yet. We got, mo- we got no. like, 75% Here, well, of it Well, here's right the now. reason. The reason I don't want to say is I want there to be some mystery to it. Absolutely. Like, I want you to say, I need to go get my picture taken with Troy because I want to find out what it's going to be. If I yeah. tell you what it is, what's the fun in that? i got to have some sort of power over this. Yeah, there goes the suspense. Yeah. So anyways, it, it, some sort of free gift to be coming your way. I don't know what it is. We yeah. want to have a murder she wrote type. Thing. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. But anyways, so get your picture taken with Troy. Add us on Instagram or Twitter, uh, and we'll hook you up with something. What will it be? I couldn't tell you. But it'll be something. Again, it won't be some, won't be like a signed photo of me or anything. It'll be sports related of some sort. I mean, we'll give you something, but we may still slip in. Yeah, something we could that's still. Yeah, it could be signed, but there'll be something else with it. Yeah, but, but it'll sorry. definitely be worth. It. And you know, it'll be fun, uh, especially if you can get Troy to do something crazy. That's the kicker. I want to see. I want to see the creativity behind the photos. Oh yeah. Like what? What could possibly? What could someone make you do while you're working? So the employees are watching you, like, why is he doing this? Oh, and, and the crazier it is, within reason, so you don't get Troy fired, uh, that'll be that'll that'll add to the yeah to the gift. I mean, as much as I love to work, I'm definitely all about a good time. I'm in it. I'm in it for the joke. So that's right. And the good news is, I've uh, made quite a reputation here to the point where I think if I do do crazy things, uh, people. I said do do. I know you did. <laughs> But uh, if I do crazy they things, they won't question it. Nobody's gonna question it. So that's the good news. Okay. Uh, all right. So that's one gimmick, if you want to say. You know, one of the one of the things that we do. The other thing that we do, uh, if you've been a part of National the last two years, you know we do the suitcases. Um, what I mean, what I mean by that is, we'll we'll do what we did last year. We'll have a gold suitcase, a silver suitcase, and a black suitcase, and inside of them will be something. Again, could be packs. Could be a. Uh, t- Store credit could be a free break spot. Any combination of those. It could be Justin Bieber cards. You never know. It, it, there, there's a, anything that we have left in the office from the past year gets dumped into these suitcases. And how this works is every sold out break, once the break's completed, we do a random. We pick one winner. If you're in the room, you get to pick the suitcase. If you're not, we randomly choose a suitcase for you. And whatever's inside that suitcase, you take home. We did do in the past where you picked a suitcase and it just said you get 
everything. And so, you got all three suitcases worth of stuff. So it's almost like a deal or no deal without the dealing part. Yeah, it's just it's just fun. Or like or like you know, let's make a deal. Yeah. You might get a whammy. Yeah. No, no. There are no whammies. Well, I guess Justin, Justin Bieber. Bieber cards. Well, 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 depending, depending on who you. <laughs> depending on who you are. How dare you call Justin Bieber a whammy? I before. You don't even know what we're talking about. Justin Where did you Bieber. come from? <laughs> Go back home. Not well, really. you, you see, 25 work. years ago, he came... Oh, <laughs> never mind. That's a story for a different All day. right, so anyways, yes. We get the suitcases. I don't want to say that in there, Alex. That's, Sorry, I'm that's taking a, a sip of a drink. To make. He was dealing um, with that. Okay, so the other thing we're going to do is at the conclusion of National. So National ends Sunday at 5 o'clock. Um, for every break that's sold out, from the Tuesday to Sunday at National, we're also going to take an additional name. We'll call you the winner, whatever you want to call it. You're the chosen one of that break. Let's just say 80 breaks sell out. That means we're going to have 80 names. One, one name from every break that's mm -hmm. sold out. We're going to take all 80 names, do one giant random using random.org. That's how we do all our randoms. The top four names. So it's going to be one random. The top four names... All four people are going to get a five hundred dollar. We get five hundred dollars in store credit to use at our store. I was going to say a gift certificate, but it's actually just going to be five hundred dollars in store credit, and you can use that however you would like. Group breaks, personal breaks, or sealed products sent to your home. So again, we're going to take one name from every break that sells out, and then Sunday at five o'clock, we're going to do one giant random. The top four people will get five hundred dollars to spend at our store. This is a thank you. Like, a, hey, thanks for buying into our breaks. Buy some more stuff. Someone's going to tell me. I think somebody's going to listen to this, and if they hear that, they might just throw up on contact. Yeah, they might. That's a lot of money. It is money. It's fun. And it's and you get you do buy that product that you weren't going to buy because you didn't want to spend your money. Get into a bunch of breaks and make that money multiply. Who knows? You well, yeah, I mean, if we're going to give you $500, people, let me tell you right now, you better uh, cycle it back <laughs> into the DACW live here. But honestly, if you wanted to just get a sealed product sent to your house, you could do that too. I'm not going to limit it to that. Um, but every year we do something. And uh, this year I thought it would be kind of cool. Last year we did spots. We gave away spots. But this way you can do what you want. You know, if you want to buy a spot, you can. If you don't, if you want to just hang on to it for a year till next national, you could. So, so maybe in theory, I mean, you could, you, could, you could hold on to it and that could be, you know, the start for the next for the next round or if you want to wait till the Black Friday sales. You know, you know promotions come up. But anyways, so four people are going to walk away with that. So four people are going to walk away with that. One person in every break is going to get a suitcase random. All the cars are going to be given out. And then there's just going to be other random things. The pictures with Troy will get you something. Um, and we might just give away stuff too because we can. I have a feeling Sean is going to play the role of Oprah this week at the National. Probably. I I have aspired to be uh, either Oprah or Nisi Nash for about 15 years now. And uh, if I could get one of those things to come true, um, it'd be amazing. You're on track for the Oprah thing because I think it's going to be like, and you well, get a suitcase. Well, I would. You get well, that's suitcase. usually like during the national, that's, I'll be Oprah. And then hopefully at the end, because it's going to be so messy, I can clean house it and be my Nisi Nash. That's a story for another day, though. Wow, you know what? Uh, I think with that being said, I think that's a good way to uh, kind of outro this one. Wait, wait, is there anything just, else? Yeah, you yeah want real to quick. Add? Just wanted to sh just highlight. Real. So we talked about baseball, basketball. We got football. Your hockey. We got a soccer breakup. We have golf, entertainment. So we got a a Fleer retro Marvel. And we also have the Hit Parade celebrity. Um, yes. We will also. Or when are you putting it up for national or now? National, all right. We're also, I just got word right, literally right now, uh, Marvel Premiere is coming out. Wow, breaking news right so now. So we're going to do it as a national break. So uh, it does come out, I think it comes out tomorrow, but we're going to tie it into the promotion um, so it's part of the national. So you, not only do you get, you, you have a chance at all the fun and mayhem. That's why if you've seen a couple of breaks get pushed back, um, that's I figured, hey, why not add them to the national and, and, and attach them to all the mayhem and foolishness. And then the last one, the other, that is that is the all-encompassing uh, big box. Actually, going to get another one of those breaks up. We got the comic breaks, the vault, sell it out, um, racing, TriStar, and a Muhammad Ali boxing. So, I mean, we there's something for everybody. 
Yeah. I tried to cover as many sports as I could, non-sports. But um, I just hope everyone comes in and, and has a fun time. And, uh, you know, we're going to be here for uh, an awful lot of hours. I mean, you're mirroring exactly when the national is going to be open, correct? Uh, yeah, and plus a little. I'm not going to lie. Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we're we're doing breaks, you know, 10, 11 in the morning. You can't do that anywhere else. So we're going to be open longer. Yeah, keep, keep that, that keep, keep that, that in mind. mind. Our we're, we're gonna be like a reading rainbow, book, Levar Burton open book, for pretty much that whole week. Pretty much. Um, and if you're watching, if you have any questions, I'll highlight it right there. Box breaks at da cardworld dot com is where you want to send us questions, and we will gladly answer them. Um, yeah, I think that's. I mean, I think that's it. I, I think, think that was a good last thing, though. I was going to ask you. You know, uh, why don't you plug us a little bit? I mean, where can you find us on Twitter? Where can you find us on Instagram? Because people are going to need to know that things if they are uh, going to participate in a lot of stuff. Well, I mean, do you want to? Yeah, I mean, you can pull up. I was going to say. I mean, this is, well, this is the easiest. I mean, so honestly, if you just go, this is the national page that I've been showing everybody. But honestly, if you just go right to dacarworld.com and click on DACW Live, that'll also bring you. And it actually breaks it down even more of what we have. But uh, don't forget, add us on Twitter. I mean, add us on Twitter at DACW Live Breaks. Add us at um, Instagram at DACW Live Breaks. You know, check those out for the latest news, Going crazy updates now. like that. Check it out. There we are. There you go. I'm getting punched by Rick Worthy. Yeah, how many people can say that? Dude, you think? He's about to destroy me. How many people do you think can say that they are? Actually, though, it's, good that, it's good that you say that. I know we said we were going to leave. This is where you're going to get your updates, though. So follow us on, follow us at DACW Live Breaks. Um, once we get a time and date for a break, we'll tweet it out. That's the – it's rapid fire at Nashville. It gets hectic and crazy, um, and we'll, we'll try our best to – do a, like a half hour bu uh, buffer. So if you're in vault number one and it sells out at noon, look for the tweet. It'll say, you know, at 2 p.m. we're going to be breaking vault number one. We'll, we'll give a little bit of a buffer, but that's where you're going to get all your information. It'll obviously be on the site, but if you're linked to us on Twitter, every time we send an update, you'll know. Absolutely. So. You want to come back on more often, or you or Alex? Because I feel like I need a co-host when I do these. It's, it's a lot more smoother than me just talking to myself the whole time. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, obviously, I think the people would want me. I'll let Alex do one and see how he does. Um, you know, and then the people can say who they we'll want. We'll do a Twitter poll. poll. You could do a Twitter poll. We'll, we'll do, do a Twitter, Twitter poll on who should be my uh, co-host. Yeah, and I'm, you know, if they if they pick Alex, you know, I'll question, but, uh, you know, I'll, I'll accept it. Because <laughs> you're the adult. Yeah, right? and I'll just make some nice comments in the background. <laughs> <laughs> hey, last thing, guys, if you want a little more information on the live vault, excuse me, don't forget to check out. Uh, we have a blog up at uh, our DACW Cardland uh, blog page. So check that out. And uh, there you go. Sean will show you real quick. What did just say it. Use your words. No, he can't. Okay. He doesn't know how to use words. Okay. But there it is right there. Yep, yep, so, so we, we have so we'll, we'll link we'll link, link this into that, that uh, post right there for you guys, guys and so you check that out. But uh, besides that, thank you for listening. We'll see you next week. Bye.